Good evening. I'm Steve Newman, and this is Channel 40 Weather Watch. It's going to be even cooler tonight than to, uh, tomorrow night than tonight. The reason for this, with the passage of the cold front today, when we picked up some showers, skies have cleared very nicely. And uh, as a result, the heating uh, radiation coming up from the Earth is going right up into the atmosphere, nothing to keep it down, thus cooling us off a lot more than uh, we normally would. That's the bad part about having clear weather. Tomorrow night's temperatures could be as low as 38 inland and 40 to 41 along the coast. For high temperatures around our area today, 68 in Bradenton, 10 degrees warmer at the Sarasota Bradenton Airport, 78, 71 at our Venice transmitter site, 78 at Fort Myers, Arcadia 75 as it was in Lakeland, Orlando 76, uh, Clearwater with 66 degrees, St. Petersburg 72, and Tampa International 61 degrees. Miami, one of the warmer spots, up to 81. Now, small craft, if you're going out in the Gulf of Mexico, I advise you not to. Small craft advisories are in effect from Fort Myers northward and from Cape Kennedy northward on the east coast. You can expect winds northwesterly 20 to 25 knots, and our seas are running between 4 and 6 feet. The saltwater temperature at New Pass is 59 degrees, and at Egmont Key, 1 degree warmer, 60 degrees. Let's take a look at some rainfall we had around our area today as displayed on the D-1500 at the Sarasota Bradenton Airport. They picked, over, picked up a little over an inch and a quarter outside of our studios, a little more than a half inch, Arcadia a little less than a quarter. Bradenton 81 one hundredths of an inch, Fort Myers 21 one hundredths, St. Pete 68, and a Venice transmitter site picked up 63 one hundredths of an inch of rainfall. It looks like we're going to be rain free all the way through this weekend. No showers forecast for tonight. And I'll be back to take a look at the national weather scene in just one moment. It's the Marine Camper Center, 41 Bypass, Venice. Well, good evening. That frontal system that moved through our state uh, is right now turned stationary, right smack dab in the middle of the Sunshine State, extending up to this low pressure cell off the Atlantic coast of New England, causing some very heavy snow showers up there, extending all the way into the Great Lakes. Heavy wind coming in out of Canada, very cold, dipping temperatures uh, way down into the teens today. Gale warnings are in effect for the entire Great Lakes region. And you know, about 36 hours ago, they had a warming trend. Well, they have a 36-hour cycle right now, this time of the year, up in New England. It'll turn cold and then warm, snow and then warm. It just happens over and over and over again. Right now, cold wave warnings are in effect for New Hampshire, I'm sorry, for Michigan, Illinois, Indiana, Wisconsin, and Minnesota tonight. Temperature is going to drop down way down to the teens and possibly the one-digit figure numbers. Today, it was uh, 8 degrees this afternoon, below zero at Bismarck, North Dakota. Further to the west, two high-pressure cells are keeping skies fairly clear over the western United States. Some sh snow shower activity in the panhandle of Texas today has dissipated as of this hour. Earlier this evening, we had some thunder shower activity in Southern California. Let's take a look now at some temperatures around our beautiful nation this afternoon, as of about 1 p.m. this afternoon. You notice San Francisco came in with 52 degrees, 60 down at L.A., 55 for Phoenix, 45 at Dallas and Fort Worth, 50 in New Orleans, 51, or rather 11 Kansas City, minus 3 at Bismarck, 6 degrees Minneapolis, St. Paul, 21 at Chicago, 26 at Detroit, 31 in Cleveland, Cincinnati, 32, 29 Buffalo, 25 up at Caribou, 42 in Boston, 45 in New York City, Philly with 46 in the nation's capital, 42 degrees. Now outside of our studios, our projected temperature 51 degrees. Winds are out of the northwest 15 to 20 miles per hour. And we've had 51 one hundredths of an inch of rainfall outside of our studio. Humidity is 78 percent. Barometric pressure is steady right now, 30 and 7 one hundredths inches. An outgoing tide in Sarasota Bay to reach a low at 707. And for our almanac, sunset this evening, 620. Sunrise tomorrow morning at 710. Now the forecast for the Channel 40 viewing area. Small craft advisories are in effect, otherwise fair through Saturday. Our low temperature tonight, 47, high tomorrow, 60, and low tomorrow night, 40 in the warmest district, as low as 37 inland, and high for the next day, 61 degrees. And that's the way I see it on the weather scene. Stay tuned next for more news. Good night.